four. They got light suits, and then they've got pyro, kind of like you just saw on Arrhythmia. Let's see what we see is. And Amanda, Cindy, and Sarah make their way down. First, he's out. Second. Third. See the jumpers continue to come out of the aircraft. One more. Right, it's flying Four. at Cisco 172 to 4,000 feet above the ground. All four shoots are open. So we've got Hannah, Amanda, Cindy, and Sarah successfully out of the aircraft. Misty Blues, if you were at the day air show earlier on the main line, you got to see them jump. When we started the air show with the national anthem, this team has been performing skydiving operations and demonstrations since 1983. They've been performing air shows since 1986. They've had four others in that time period, and in fact, two of them are still with the team. There's actually ten women that are on this all-female skydiving team, and you get to see four of them right here tonight at Twilight Flight Day. They performed all over the world, including United Arab Emirates, Japan, Malaysia, Canada, and Puerto Rico. Here's an interesting thing to note. The average number of jumps for the team members that Misty Blues is a thousand jumps. That's the newbie. The newbie's got a thousand jumps, right? So wow, how about that? The women on the team have regular jobs. They're not parachute uh, jumpers for a living. They have all kinds of different careers. We see them circling above. Now you can start to see some of the sparklers, a little bit of the pyro. How about that on a nice evening when it's almost getting dark? That is absolutely spectacular. So these women in their regular day jobs, they've got two of them that are plumber and pipe fitters. They've got welding instructors, financial analysts, a math instructor, a civil engineer, an aerospace engineer, a farmer, a gemologist, and a jewelry designer. So, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, you too can do this. The message there is, no matter what you do, passion for aviation, you too can become successful and excel at it. Just like the Misty Blues, when you see them do. Professional women skydivers are just killing it, doing it here tonight, jumping out of this airplane. Watch the flying parachutes. Now, these are ram air shoots that they have. It works just like a wing. So once it's in place, you can see it's shaped like a wing. They have a uh, control on either side with their hands. Similar to what you saw with the power of the paraglider. So this is actually a little bit more uh, fast forward, a little more maneuverability, uh, if you will. These canopies are, uh, are lightweight. And in each parachute, had they needed it, as a backup parachute, if something were to happen, they can uh, release this first one and then rely on the second parachute to come out and bring them down safely. But we don't need that here tonight. We've got them expertly navigating their way down. Check out those suits. With the, you can see we got, I got blue and I got red. See purple? Man, those are awesome. Light, light suits here on the Misty Blues. So as you see they're making their way down, we've got a couple of cars out there so that they can see where we're headed and they can see the landing zone there off the runway here in the skull area. I'll tell you one thing that the ground does really well, ladies and gentlemen, that reflects sound. So if you'll make some noise, they can hear you, I promise you. They're going to fly harder, they're going to land better. If they hear you cheer it for them, let's give it up to Misty Blues. Doing a great job for us here tonight. Look at that. Right on target. Professionally done. That is absolutely awesome. One more to go. Look at that beautiful light suit. That is something. LED lights are special. Wow, look at there we go, ladies and gentlemen. All four of them are on the ground. Let's get the huge round.